In Bolivia, the implementation of a drought immediate response plan has begun. This phenomenon affects 153 municipalities in eight of the country's nine departments. This rain's fall shortage is expected to last until the first quarter of next year. From La Paz, our correspondent Freddy Morales with more. The government has created a cabinet with four ministries of state responsible for executing the so-called drought immediate response plan. There is going to be rainfall, but it will be scarce, and in many municipalities it will be quite scarce, which will cause a drought and will have an impact on production and also on food security. Comrades, in this sense, the president has formed a cabinet for this emergency, the cabinet to fight against the drought. The emergency plan began in La Paz Altiplano with the distribution of water storage tanks, pipes and tanker trucks to the municipalities suffering from the lack of rainfall. With the supply of water for human consumption, water for irrigation, water to recover the production, brothers and sisters of a Bolivian Altiplano, and also water for animal consumption and for our livestock activities. The plan calls for the drilling of wells and the construction of water cutoffs for harvesting and storage. This crisis obviously has a background. Not only the consequences of an excessive deforestation, but also the global phenomenon that is part of a merciless capitalism that in the name of globalization, in the name of the use and abuse of our natural resources, is affecting the environment. The emergency plan foresees an immediate investment of $4 million in the first month and almost $30 million up to the first quarter of the next year. According to the weather forecast, the lack of rainfall will last until March of next year. 153 municipalities in eight of the nine departments are under the state of emergency due to the damage caused by the drought. Freddy Morales, Telesur, Bolivia.